What's up, my comic community? My name's Cullen, and I collect comics, and uh, today is, oh, Wednesday, and uh, we're going to do my Things from Another World order from probably a couple weeks ago. Things from Another World is a, uh, they're a comic shop out of the West Coast, Pacific Northwest. They're out of, I think, like, you know, uh, Oregon. I've been getting books from them for quite a while and let's see what we got this time this week's order should be pretty decent now I got one coming next week that's huge from them like next week's videos I should have quite a lot of stuff Alright. Oh, it's raining. Alright. No, 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 no. I do not want those to fall. Because my dog likes to try to eat those things. Alright. Wow, we got a lot of books here. Actually, while we're starting, y'all want to look at, you can see the Penthouse Comics number two. This is the Lee Eric's cover. And it's pretty sweet. Uh, I also, because I don't always, but... I really like a lot of the stuff by oh, Vesecchio and stuff like that. And so we've got this second Penthouse Comics cover right here that was really the one I like had to have. You know, like I got the A cover just to get the A cover too. But I figure I'll get each one of them. I'm not sure I ordered three. All right. We got a pretty fat stack here. And get started. We've got all right, and this was what the Penthouse Comics was. Yeah, Luna Vicetio. Love that cover. All right, first we're gonna start with Animal Pound from Boom, and this is issue number three. I think there's maybe four or five of these that are, you know, or four. So one more and then it's out. Next, we've got an awesome window shade variant of Hawkeye and Black or Black Eye Widow and Hawkeye, which mainly, you know, I'm picking this up because I love Widow stuff. I'm not really the hugest Hawkeye fan. Not that I don't like Hawkeye at all. All right. Next, we have this awesome Inyuk Lee cover of Catwoman number 64. Look at that. I like Inyuk Lee a lot. Of course, I also like Derek Chu a lot, too, which Derek Chu did this cover. Then, we have another Catwoman, 64, with, boom, Jim Lee. This is a cool Jim Lee cover. Like, this is a really cool Jim Lee cover. I want to look at it again. Like, I really, like, the two people that really got me started collecting comics, I feel like, are Jim Lee and Mark Silvestri. Like, I mean, I picked up books when I was younger, like a little bit, but I mean, I didn't really stick around until I started seeing their work and absolutely loving it. Next, we have Cobra Commander number four, which I think there's one more of these, and Cobra Commander's done. We have Fall of the House of X. Who did that cover on Cobra Commander, anyway? Uh, oh, Milana Leone. Next, we got this EM Gist Emma Frost variant of uh, oh, uh, House of uh, Fall of the House of X number four. Next, we got issue number two 
of Boombox's I Heart Skull Crusher. I've been picking up all of these. Uh, how many is uh, I Heart Skull Crusher? There's five, so, you know, three more issues to go with that. Next, we've got Kill Your Darlings, and this has number eight. It's got a beautiful cover. And then we have number nine. I need to get back on this book. For real, like... And, of course, this is the uh, Stegman cover, the second one. But I need to get back on reading this book because I love this book. Kill Your Darlings is a great concept. Next, we got two copies of one for me, one for my cousin James, of Moon Man. This is the Kid Cudi book. Next, we're going also for my cousin, because my cousin collects this. We've got Rick and Morty Finals Week. Boom. All right. Next, we got Something Epic number nine. I've been picking up all the Something Epics. This one I kind of went a little crazy on compared to normal because uh, I got this thing. I love duck characters. And, of course, they've got this. Looks like a duck detective. Kind of reminds me of Howard the Duck. So, of course. And we finally have that Limp Biscuit significant other homage but yeah next we got spider boy number six with a peach moco cover that's absolutely awesome we have superman number 13 with this jim lee bizarro cover We have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, the Untold Destiny of the Foot Clan. We have this A cover, and I accidentally ordered this uh, B cover, which, uh, you know, uh, this Medell cover, this B cover, actually is really cool, and I'm kind of glad I did. I like Genghis Frog over there. Next, we've got a Ultimate Black Panther number three with this awesome storm uh, designed by Peach Moko. And now we have a What If number, Venom number three, also with a cool peach cover. And yeah, this is all the stuff I picked up recently from Things From Another World. Uh, I uh, really like their uh, stuff, but uh, like I said, they always, uh, they always, they've been like, you know, I've picked up a lot of books from a lot of different, uh, you know, mail orders, and they're the ones that I've been sticking with. They've been pretty good. I mean, every once in a while I'll get something, but, you know, everyone's going to miss something every once in a while. But I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching. Hit like and subscribe. Uh, tell me what comic books you're you've been checking out, things like that, and I will holler at y'all later. See ya.